Hello everyone, here is the storyline for the episode that aired last night. In this episode, Jungi once again heard the truth revealed by Mija that Donggu and Junyo were not having an affair 30 years ago. Mija also said that Jungi was influenced by the talk of neighbors who often gossiped, almost causing many couples to divorce at a time. Jungi considered Mija's words, but she was still hesitant to believe it. So she asked Kizuk to look for another person who also lived in her area. She wanted to hear the story from someone else, not just from Mija. She needed more information to make up her mind. In this episode, Ansong and Sun were planning to hide their relationship from their colleges. However, Yuna and Jaejun overheard their romance. In the end, Sun Wen and Song decided to tell Yuna and Jaejun that they were dating again. Apart from that, Sun Wu also called Jion to the company to explain that he couldn't accept her feelings because he was dating and song again. Jion reacted calmly and accepted Sun Wu's decision wisely. And song did the same thing with Jeha, telling him about her relationship with Sun Wu. Jeha prayed for and song's well-being. In this episode, there is a character named Dalyan who greets Jun Young in a friendly manner. However, Chun Young doesn't really like him because Dalyang reverts to her as an in-law. Dalyang realizes that he cannot just focus on Dong and Chun Young, so he contacts Jung Ye, who is an Hyuk's biological mother. Dalyang wants to meet Jung Ye to ask for her support in an Hyuk's and Chun Hyung's relationship. This leads to a confrontation between the three of them, An Hyuk and Hyung at Haha Chicken. They once again oppose An Hyuk and Hyung's relationship. But at that moment, Hyung feels nauseous and almost vomits. It turned out she is pregnant and they decide to get married. Another story involves Garam, who couldn't find Yeon. The woman who resembled Yeon turned out not to be her. Garam couldn't go to the airport of Vietnam because he was still very young. He hides at an Ha's house where Anna is delighted to find Garam. She converts Garam, who has low self-esteem. Anna is very good at calming Garam and making him happy again. After Garam finishing bathing, Minko comes to pick up Garam from Anha's house. He is not angry at Garam at all and allows him to look at Yeon's photo and talk about her. This cheers up Garam and he becomes cheerful again as usual. Okay everyone, that's the storyline for this time and thank you for watching my video.